2022, Mexico. The third circle is for the hotness that is Mexico. Woo! The top 15, go Natalie. Yeah, and somewhere in that group of 15 gorgeous women is the new Miss Universe. Now, any one of them could win the crown and be catapulted onto an amazing year long. Mexico. Number five spot now, Mexico. <laughs> Jimena Navarrete would like to work with women who suffer from eating disorders. She enjoys watching sunsets and spending time with her family. I study nutrition and I would like everyone to understand that it is not about your looks, it is how you feel inside. And when you feel good inside, you look good. Mexico! I chose a red dress because this year Mexico is celebrating 200 years of independence and this color has a lot of meaning. Top five will face the judges one last time for the demanding final question. How they answer will determine which one of them will become Miss Universe 2010. So now in random order once again, here are the judges top five finalists. We begin with Mexico. Congratulations to our top five finalists. I think the whole country of the Philippines is here tonight. Up, please come on over, Mexico, and come select your card. Go ahead. Por favor, seleccione una tarjeta. And you selected judge number four, Evan Lysacek. Go ahead, Evan. Please ask your question. In your opinion, what effect is unsupervised internet use having on today's youth? En tu opinión, exactamente. ¿Qué impacto tiene el uso no supervisado del Internet en la juventud del día de hoy, de hoy día? Buenas noches, Las Vegas. Good evening, Las Vegas. Bueno, creo que el Internet es una herramienta realmente necesaria, indispensable en, en, esto, en estos tiempos, en estos momentos. Well, I do believe that Internet is an indispensable, necessary tool for the present time. Y definitivamente tenemos que cuidar lo que nuestros hijos ven, lo que lo, nuestros adolescentes ven 
Y bueno, simplemente inculcarles desde jóvenes que, bueno, valores y todo este tipo de cosas que se aprenden en la familia. And we must be very careful and watch over what our children watch and see, our teenagers watch and see, and we, we must be sure to teach them the values that we learn as a family. Para que ellos puedan hacer un buen uso del internet. So that they may use internet properly. Gracias. Thank you. Thank you, Mexico. Gracias. Now let's have Australia. Australia, please join us. Go ahead and select your card. Next, we're going to reveal the woman the judges have chosen to take the title, the Diamond Nexus Labs crown, and a lot. So one last time, here are our top five in their evening gowns. Let's begin with Mexico. The new Miss Universe will be awarded a package of incredible prizes. Here's a look. Woo. There are two women left. Jamaica and Mexico, are you ready? Please. I think I am more nervous now than anyone here, man. I am pumped up. All right, here we go. Their fates have been determined, and there is no turning back now. One of them is about to become Miss Universe 2010. Now, we should remind you, if for any reason the new Miss Universe cannot fulfill her duties, the first runner-up will take over. Okay, here we go. Ready? I can't breathe. My heart's a pump. First runner-up is... Jamaica, which means Mexico! You are! 2010 What is going through your mind right now? ¿Cómo te sientes? No puedo pensar nada. Perdón, estoy en blanco. I can't think of anything. You look beautiful. You How about a big round of applause? Congratulations, Miss Mexico. Please enjoy this moment as you take your first walk as Miss Universe Ooh. 2010. Mexico, Miss yeah. Universe 2010. And thanks again to Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino here in Las Vegas. Thanks to you, Brett. You've been a wonderful partner. Thank you, Natalie. This has been awesome. I love every second of it. And now I'm going to love the after party. I'm glad they taped this because I don't think I'm going to remember anything tomorrow. <laughs> Definitely not. We'll see you next year to crown Miss USA 2011. Thank you, everybody. Until Hotel